how are you able to be so effective on the court despite the fact that you're not fast, you don't jump so high, not like an athlete? This year, Bill Russell, finals MVP goes to Nikola Jokic. Basketball is uh, you know, it's about teammates, you know. When I open, I score. When I, uh, I pass, you know, play basketball. Just uh, play simple, simple as I can, you know, something like that. With the 41st pick in the 2014 NBA Draft, the Denver Nuggets select Nikola Jokic from Sombra, Serbia. Was there a moment when you realized, oh wow, this guy could become who he has become? There was a game in his rookie season at San Antonio, and he put up a crazy stat line it's against a guy like Tim Duncan. What he just did on the road against this team, coached by that guy, this kid has a chance to be a special player. Oh, 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 oh. We realized that we had a player that we could build an offense and a team and an organization around. Very high basketball IQ. Joker again, spinning right on the point guard. Nice drop step move by Nikola Jokic. Comes Jokic handling again. Behind the back, Nikola Jokic to the rim. Denver Nuggets center Nikola Jokic has been voted the NBA's most valuable player for a second consecutive season. I think it was the right guy, but Joel Embiid is still in the playoffs. He right. could be an NBA champion, and that's way more. That's worth more to me than getting an MVP. Right. I voted for Embiid, but I knew Jokic was going to win. A lot of voters today pay attention to advanced statistics. My vote was for Embiid, and I, I don't want to change it. I don't want to take it back. Uh, let me tell you something about Nikola Jokic that you may not know. The guy's a horse lover. And since he's back in his native land now that the Nugget season is over, if you want to find him, you got to head to the stables. Do you think Nicola's kind of redefined what dominance looks like at that big man position where he's not maybe not the strongest, maybe not the fastest, but he's getting it done in a dominant way? He's got amazing touch, IQ, passing. Players that can just do everything. He's kind of like breaking that mold, kind of like how Magic Johnson did with the point guard position. I think you you need if you want to be a successful you need a couple of years you need to you need to be a bad then you need to be the good and then you need to figure then you need to when you're good you need to fail um, and then when you fail you're going to figure it out you know i think the experience is something that is not what happened to you is what you're going to do with that with happen what happened to you, you know speed and quickness are overrated i'll, I'll take skill <laughs> and just amazing basketball iq i mean nicole can do everything Oh, what a pass. And the layup is perfect. What a pass. Come on now. Joker. Oh, Nicole Jokic bought the ball. Not today, buddy. To be honest, I'm playing this way since I started playing basketball. Oh, my gosh. What oh. a pass. Jokic on the run behind the back. Here he goes. Two to shoot. Hook shot is good. Wow. As good as it gets. Oh, look at that. It's rare to be nearly a decade in and still be playing with the same running mate for the same head coach, let alone win a championship together. Why did it mean more to you to win with Jamal Murray and Michael Malone than winning period? Because I really, I really trust those guys and I think that's the most important thing. Jokic underneath the corner. Hey! Wow. Puts it in there. Wow. This guy is unbelievable. This is seven footer, folks. Looks up to see how much time he has. Look at the handle. My goodness. Jokic. Shoots the shot clock buzzer. Jokic on the run. And he puts it away. Ooh, that was beautiful. 
just positioning. It's all about positioning and his timing. He's so unique in like what he does. He don't want to talk about no accolades of himself. He's, he's all about winning in the team. Great pass and Jokic dunks it through. It's always a wow moment. And the stuff he does, like, it's so easy. Like, he makes the right play every single time. Unhanded, just perfect. Oh, oh what a pass by Jokic. A look away, as good as it gets. Beautiful. That's probably really easy for Nikola Jokic, but any other human being on the planet Earth, that is a toughie. Everybody keeps talking about the MVP awards. How much are you thinking about that? I'm not, I never play basketball to win, uh, to, to win individual awards. So I'm just uh, the people and media around uh, trying to make a story of it. Uh, I don't play for that. As long as we're winning, uh, I'm happy. The Joker inside on the skip. Dumps it down in the corner. Jokic, and... the table for Gordon. He needs the bubble, Murray. If he returns to that level, this Denver Nuggets team is going to be a hand. Jokic inside. <laughs> the Serbian sensation starting to make him dizzy. Well, Jokic just masterful. It's a beautiful job with the footwork. Jokic bangs into Booker, flicks it up, and it goes. Jokic up top. Gordon. No one talked about Nikola just had a historic performance. He's got 13 triple doubles now, third all time. What he's doing is just incredible, but the narrative wasn't about the Nuggets. The narrative wasn't about Nikola. The narrative is about the Lakers and their adjustments. So, you know, you put that in your pipe, you smoke it, and you come back, and you know what? We know our narrative in that locker room. We know that we're not done. We haven't done anything yet. So uh, we're not celebrating. You know, this is not cause for celebration. This is a cause to continue to dig deep and find ways to be better. This is a big time move. Jokic just gets it off in time. It's up. Oh, it's good. Of course it goes in. Jokic from downtown. Anthony Davis just stares at him. Still undefeated at home. Uh, well, we, I think we all agree with this. Good win. All right, Western Conference Finals up 1-0. We'll take it. But our defense has to be a lot better. Cameo three, one, two, three, three. Yeah. Well, the Nuggets remain perfect at home in these playoffs after topping the Lakers on Tuesday night. Jokic gets into the paint, flips it up, shots good and one. Jokic spinning, shooting, scoring, and the foul. Murray fires away at three. It's good. Jamal Murray struggling all night, making some big buckets here in the fourth. Bang! Jamal Murray once again from downtown. Nicola, rumor has it you got the defensive player of the game chain tonight. And I, I, what was working that you were doing? Jokic spins, count it, and one. Disappointing crowd, obviously. Lakers heading for the locker room. And Denver is one win away from Nuggets history with an emphatic 11 point win on the road. The Nuggets now 11 and 3 in these playoffs. Coach, NBA Finals, how does that sound? <laughs> Amazing. How did your team come together to get this job done? I think it starts with a belief in themselves, but probably more importantly in the collective. It means a lot to get the first Western Conference Championship in franchise history. In the first half, LeBron James with 31 points and a 15-point lead. But I speak for 17 players in that locker room and the entire organization. We are not satisfied. We're going to enjoy it for a moment. I think it's going to be a hell of a plane ride home. We have a lot of work to do. No good, still alive. Jokic lays it up and in, and the foul. And the lead is cut to five. You have a great player, Nicole Jokic, who continues to show how great of a player he is on whatever stage. You have the return of Jamal Murray coming back from an injury, missing significant time, playing at the level he's playing at. 
that a lot of other guys have stepped up to put us in this position. I mean, from Michael Porter and Aaron Gordon to KCP, to Bruce, to Jeff, to all the guys on our bench. So we have tremendous ownership. We have a tremendous front office, and I have an outstanding coaching staff. Up top to Jokic, inside to Gordon, throws it down, and the foul. Jokic with another perfect pass. Shot clock at four. Jokic has to put it up. Falling away, puts it up. Bang! Nikola Jokic knocks it down. On the inbound, Jokic drives and puts it up and in. Four seconds remaining, Lakers down to Reeves holding. James comes out of the pack. James on the drive, goes inside, stop. Jock Lock gets it back. It's over! It's over! Denver makes history. The Nuggets are going to the NBA Finals for the first time in franchise history. I think in life, not just in sports, but in life, you have to enjoy moments. The guys behind me, uh, they believe since training camp. Love this group. Let's go Nugget Nation! If you don't enjoy the small victories and the moments along the way, I think you're missing something. At the same time, we have much work in front of us. Our goal is to win a championship, and obviously, um, you know, that's in front of us still. Coaching Nicola is more of a partnership. He's a, an incredible player with an IQ that is unmatched in our, in our league and, and probably it would be considered up there with the greatest of all time already. These fans, this city, waited 47 years to host an NBA Finals game. My hero. I was curious if you feel like being the best player. My hero. In a superstar league, if that matters, or if you feel like it doesn't matter because of how you look at the game. My hero. I'm confused. My hero. Sometimes I am, sometimes I'm not, and I'm cool with that. Nice entry pass, Jokic, and Gordon with a couple of dunks early on. Jokic finds Murray. Murray wide open. Gordon, very aggressive, gets another one to go. Gordon sees an opening. Euro step left handed. Aaron Gordon bursting out of the gate here in game one. 15 for Murray here in the first half. Nice pass from Murray. Jokic flips it up and in. These two guys have been allowed to grow together. Murray. Up top, Jokic. Shot clock winding down. Knocks down the three. Brown sets, fires, and hits. Jokic falling away. Puts it in. First finals game in franchise history is a rousing success. My hero. My hero. Denver, they move, as you're saying, a different animal there to try to defend. And you hear the cheers here at Ball Arena because the man himself is on his way to the set. Nikola Jokic, fresh off his ninth postseason triple-double of the spring. First win, three more wins ago, you'll be a champion. How do you... How do you stay even keel like you are now? Uh, to be honest, I, I'm not excited to be honest. I'm, I'm really uh, focused because I know what they're capable of. They, they did their job on their home floor. You have to say that. We will adjust, do some things very differently, and uh, come out here and be ready to get one for game two. We just, as a team, we have a huge respect for the Miami Heat. Our focus and our mentality is not to relax, it's just to get better. Time for the Miami Heat and the Denver Nuggets game two of the NBA Finals. Struess, two for two to start. How about that for Struess? All for 10 in game one. And Miami comes out firing away. Jokic enables the crowd to sit. The Miami Heat have come out with a vengeance here. Nikola Jokic, a scoring machine. That's ridiculous. Robinson fires. Butler, corner three. It's good. Big buckets. Four seconds. Murray, step back, three-pointer.
Slow go, fight for the rebound, Martin, and it's over. The Miami Heat have tied the NBA Finals. I mean, this is the NBA Finals, and we're talking about effort. That's a huge concern of mine. This is not the preseason. This is not the regular season. It's not round. This is the NBA Finals. Enjoy this moment. Enjoy this opportunity and embrace it. And play with an urgency and a desperation that embodies that. We didn't have that in game two. It's probably oversimplifying things when teams play against Jokic. You turn him into a scorer, you turn him into a passer, and he controls the game. He only had four assists tonight. Yeah, that's ridiculous. Wait for it, seven. Let's get back in the series tonight. Get back home for the game. Let's go. That's the untrained eye that says something like that. Jokic backs in. This guy's an incredible player. He's too big and too strong. Twice in two seasons, he's been the best player on this planet. You can't just say, oh, make him a score. Jokic, the feed, and Christian Brown throws it down. Here's Jokic, back up top to Murray. Murray, the drive, backs it all. You and Jamal have had so many giant games together, but... For, it made history tonight with the two triple doubles. How would you explain the dynamic that you guys have? It's oh. just respect to each other and the relationship over the years and communication. The Denver Nuggets win their fourth straight road game in these playoffs, regain home court advantage. But it's not just us, it's a team. And like I said before, even the series started, Denver Nuggets need to beat uh, Miami, not me or Jamal beat whoever is on the other side. We as a group need to beat them. Tonight is tonight, baby. Game four. Denver, Miami, I don't know who's going to win, but I tell you what, somebody will. You better watch it. It's going to be off the chain. No. Jokic, Vincent looks to help. Jokic doesn't need it as he scores. Murray again, picking up Butler. Gets into the paint, finds out of bio. Left-handed, beautiful shot from Bam out of bio. Got it. That is a tough shot. But the Butler fires away. And All right, same energy. Right here, pick it up. We get what we want. Keep going. Gordon, the three-pointer. That's good. Gordon hits another three. Gordon across the lane. Shot is good. Up catch from Gordon. What a strong finish. That was not an easy pass, an easy catch. Jokic from way downtown. Oh, well, Paul. Oh, what a pass. From the 28-foot line, and Gordon throws it down. Here comes Lowry. Inside for Bam out of mile. That's some NBA power right there, and the Heat back with it four. Oh, another great touch pass, and Gordon with a beautiful finish. And Brown drives, layup, banks it in off the glass. Open up. You're going to have wide open shot. Caldwell Pope grabs it, knocks it loose. Here comes Gordon. Gordon to Caldwell Pope. Caldwell Pope, three-pointer. The Denver Nuggets are one win away from their first ever NBA title. Describe what the mentality it takes when you guys are, are able to thrive in the fourth quarter, when Joker gets into foul trouble and goes to the bench, and why that didn't phase you. We're just ready to win the championship. We have the tools to do it. This has been on our minds for a while, so we're just locked in. It's the Miami Heat and the Denver Nuggets in Game 5 of the NBA Finals. They are loud and ready. They've waited a long time for this night. Do you believe in serendipity, fate? Can a piece of clothing help determine the future? This photo shows a five-year-old Nikola Jokic in his hometown of Sambor, Serbia. He is rocking a Denver Nuggets sweatshirt. Now that you guys are NBA champions and, and you kind of look around the locker room and look at your teammates, who are you most happy for? All of them, you know, I think it's simple. It's all of them, you know, it's, I'm happy for DJ. I'm happy for Jeff. I'm happy for Ish, Mikey. Yeah, he had three surgeries and still uh, came here to help us win the championship. KCP, you know, he brought us the championship mentality. Bruce, Christian Brown, Jamal, who, who had a surgery. We all know what he is capable of. of. Nicola, 41st pick in the draft. It's been an incredible journey for you to get to this moment. How would you describe the emotions of this all? I think we played the best basketball.
Jump shot from Fogo. Pope is good for the first bucket for Denver. I think it's a great journey, like you said, uh, for the first pick. But to be honest, that doesn't matter. When you're here, you're a player. They have a couple of guys that are uh, not even drafted and they're still playing and contributing them to win. What a huge impact off the bench. What a block by Love. Bad pass stolen by Butler. Butler gets inside. This time he's able to finish and the lead's back up to eight. Take care of the ball. Rebound the basketball. We'll get this win. Jokic backs in and easily scores. Ball pumped away by Jokic. Porter drives between the legs. Layup is good. How did he get that to go in? Porter at three. Punch it in. Jokic spins against Adebayo. Tough shot falling away. Still knocks it down. Christian Brown blocked from behind by Struess. Blocked by Gordon. Butler, Potter three, nails it, and the Heat take a one-point lead. Kevin Durant is good. He can have an open look every time. Mark on him. Jokic drives down the lane. Layup is good. Rebound. Brown knocks it home. Bruce Brown puts the Nuggets back up by one. Jimmy Butler on the drive gets inside, stops. Stolen by Caldwell Pope. After 47 years, the Denver Nuggets can finally call themselves NBA champions. There's such joy right now in the Mile High City. The first title in franchise history. Nikola Jokic and the Denver Nuggets win it all. Jamal Murray has always dreamed for moments like this. Better stars make so much money, they turn into little kids in moments like this. It's the moments that they dreamed of their entire lives, Mike. They put so much energy and effort into it. Well deserved, not just for the players, but for the entire coaching staff in this organization. And the last step is after a champion is to be a dynasty. So we're not satisfied. We accomplished something this franchise has never done before, but we have a lot of young, talented players in that locker room. And I think we just showed through 16 playoff wins what we're capable of on the biggest stage in the world. So I'm curious what you are feeling right now and if you're looking forward to a parade coming up in Denver. When is parade? When is parade? Thursday. No. <laughs> I need to go home. I'm okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. Let's go. I got a vision I see in my head, a melody buried deep into my soul. They call us crazy, we cutting the edge, unlocking the future and letting it go. This is a calling that's higher the time we decided our stories are gonna be told. This is what legends are born, we paving the road, a future that favors the bold. Break the rules, break the laws, this is the moment we change it all. Break the rules, break the laws, this is the moment we change it all. Yeah, it feels like greatness. Woo! Greatness. Yeah, it feels like greatness. Legendary in the making. Reach out and we take it. Not to emerge, we on the verge, and it feels like yeah. greatness. Something coming, I can feel it. Deep down in my spirit. Revolution, it's a new day.